Well, it is Saturday, November. It's November 30th, right? Mm -hmm. November 30th, and this morning, me and Allison are on the way to Bojangles to meet Jerry and Brenda Creel. They were going to the Georgia game. Yep, we're gonna go get a biscuit. We wanted to go kind of alone, but Papa wanted to get a biscuit, so. And we love them, so we want to. We're going to get a biscuit with them, and then we'll be hitting 85 right there in Palmetto and heading north, and we ain't stopping until we get to Bobby Dodd Stadium. See, what we got going on here is my Georgia Bulldogs are going to be playing the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets in the Yellow Jacket Stadium. So, let's see here. We got, what is Georgia, 10-1 now? 10-1, 11-1, something like that. No, they're 10-1. And, and soon Georgia to be, Tech, soon to be 11-1. Georgia Tech's what, 2-8? Georgia Tech is 3-8. and eight. They three. barely scraped out a win versus NC State. Last Wednesday night, I think it was. We're ready so, to eat some bumblebees. So, I'll tell you what's going to happen here. We're going to run Brian Harrigan right at you. And we're going to run DeAndre Swift right at your face. And you ain't going to do nothing about it. My Georgia Bulldogs have three hours of playtime against the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets. This is like a scrimmage game. This would be like the Patriots play in Alabama. This is going to be an utter freaking beatdown. I mean, they're going to drag their sorry nerd. I mean, if you if, if, if you need a daggum map and a protractor to find the stadium, then maybe football is just not your sport. <laughs> okay? This ain't about science. Go back to your go back to your science lab with your mixing tubes and crap. This is football. Don't talk about academics because the SEC, I'm so tired of hearing about Georgia Tech, but mainly, and I, I hate to bring Notre Dame into this. Notre Dame talking about, oh well, well we're a, we're an academic school. We uh, we have a higher standard in academics. Well, guess what? Notre Dame and Georgia Tech, the SEC has multiple schools with higher academic success than Notre Dame and Georgia Tech. So don't come with me. But this is not this is not this ain't a this ain't a academic decathlon or a spelling bee or something like that this is football this is football and y'all just y'all don't have the jimmies and joes to compete with us have you seen georgia tech's defensive line oh my god it looks like a bunch of receivers trying to go out there and get after the quarterback first off that's why the defensive line is so small because nobody's going to georgia tech to get chop blocked every day in practice with a triple option offense i know they've changed the offense so when people get on here and comment about, oh, Georgia Tech don't run triple option no more. Well, no shit, I know. Any, anyway, I, what I'm trying to say is we're 10 and one. You we're know, going we, to the game. We're, we're gonna go to the game. And we got pretty decent seats. Yeah, $585 worth of seats. Uh, let's see, we've beaten, let's see, we're the number four team in the country. Uh, probably going to the playoffs after we beat LSU. Uh, We've beaten number six or seven Florida, number twelve or thirteen Auburn, number seven or eight Notre Dame at the time. Let's see, we've got we just beat number twenty-four Texas A&M. We've got that's four quality wins, I think. And uh, Georgia Tech. I tell you what, though, Georgia Tech is three and eight. But could Georgia Tech possibly have a more a, a better a better win over a quality opponent than Alabama? I don't know. Alabama beat 24 Texas A&M. Georgia Tech beat Miami. Is that is that better? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I know what a touchdown is. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> all I know is all I know is this is about to be an utter ass whooping. Georgia Tech, I tell you what, the Bulldogs are going to come out on the field and do their stretches and warm ups and this and that and you know what? Georgia will be there, and they're going to kick the ball off at 12 o'clock if y'all want to play. Uh, it's going to be an utter just, just biblical destruction of a football program. And it's sad because it's their senior day, but I don't care. They're, uh, my, my, my predicted final score, and I, I know Georgia's offense is struggling, but come on, man. It's a Georgia Tech. Look at this. Look at this defense. 
I think Georgia's going to open up some offense today, and I, my, my final predicted score, and, and I don't ever say this, I never in a college football game say this, so don't 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 get in the comment section and be like, well, you know, you just you just one of those people that always say the other team ain't even going to score. No, I, I never do this. Georgia, 38. Georgia Tech, zero. Georgia Tech won't score today. So y'all drag y'all's uh, second shift Waffle House team out on the field because uh, Georgia's about to gorilla drag your ass for about three hours. This is going to be the worst three hours of your life. And we got one more thing to show you before we're in this part of the vlog. What? Flags? It's going to be kind of hard to show the flags. Okay, I can't show the flags. <laughs> yeah, we got our flags. Go dog, sick them. Go dog. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> One more thing that just crossed my mind about today's matchup. After Georgia could just gorilla drags Tech all up and down the field it just effortlessly. I mean, we could put the third string in and literally beat y'all somewhere around 21 to 13 or something like that. But that's not the case. We're going to have the big guys in there and just dominate you all day. It's just, just going to be the worst three hours of your life. But another thing, see, I'm rambling here. I get to rambling. Another thing that just crossed my mind, after Georgia just – stomps a mud hole in your ass after today, guess what? We're going to an SEC championship game against LSU. And where are you going? You're going back home with a three-win season.
me hold it round cause I can't got them bitches. We just got a clock for the attention. Swaggin' in the kitchen, got a clock with the extension. Homies need this and you will be forgot to mention. Ain't nobody in your niggas, ain't they got the pot to piss in. I whippin' in the kitchen, tryna check in on the million. One choppy ass nigga, I just bought another bitch. I called another, they were cookin' head and diamond shit. Ain't this the type of feeling we your beings make you feel? I'm whippin' in the kitchen, tryna check in on the million. Uh oh, the party's up here. There's the varsity. <laughs> We're gonna go back under that tunnel in a minute. I just. These people have been here since 7 o'clock this morning. How do you like, I wouldn't want to get some money all that. Ah, I didn't have to. 
Hey look, there's a the stadium over there, you see the lights? Yeah. We could have went under the tunnel, but we're going to take the long way around. We're going to walk across the big bridge. Do they have bathrooms there? They got bathrooms in the stadium. What's going on? Go dog. Best party in Atlanta. Georgia Tech dorm rooms. I ran cable in 90% of these things. <laughs> yeah. Hey, well, it ain't that much closer. Jerry's picked me up at that gas station before. Do what now? Nah, I ain't got no tickets, man. It's sold, it's sold out, brother. <laughs> tickets. Oh, we got them. I used to work every day, baby. This is freaking me out. Why? I think I've done anything like this in my life. <laughs> Go dogs. Go dogs. Yeah. Look right. at all these locks. What's that for? People just putting them up there. Homeless people find locks and just put them up there for no reason. Hot Atlanta. Oh, you like no, you're all right. Go ahead and get in it. <laughs> yeah, these two dorm rooms right here, we completely demoed out all the old cable and put in a whole new wireless system for every room. Oh, my God. Hot Lana. That's Uga's car. The red car. Yeah. Where is it? That is the red car. They done took him in, I think. That's his car. <laughs> you like it, baby? Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Better than the Braves game, ain't it? Yes. This football, honey. Oh yeah. Oh, they're fired up, baby. They're gonna get it midfield in a minute, get each other's places.
sun done came out. Tyreek Stevenson. this day. What happened, baby? Tell us what happened. We're <laughs> 